Okay, so making this video in response to there's a band called Outcast that did a song called Hey Ya. Uh, okay, it came out a few years ago, like maybe a little over 10 years ago. And I never did like the song. I always thought it was a piece of crap. Nothing against Outcast or um, them as people or them personally. I don't hate them, but that particular song I hate, Hey Ya. Uh, and, um, I, you know, to be fair to the song, and what I'm criticizing, I did watch the video, and it has over 94 million views. How is that possible? I mean, this song is so bad. It, uh, I mean, President Obama should issue a presidential order, and it should go around America and seize every copy of this song. It should be unreleased. Um, anybody has it on their computer, like, no matter what else you have, we don't, you know, who cares if you're doing whatever, just you know, automatically seize that particular song. No, no criminal action, but just seize that song like it's a recall product of some sort. But I mean, when they were in the studio recording it, the producer should have, uh, I mean, it's just atrocious, you know, should have like, I, I mean, somebody should have came in and said, okay, you can no longer produce, and to Outkast, you can no longer make music. I mean, again, I'm not a real big fan. I can't really describe their whole body of work, so, I'll give him somewhat of a pass. Um, I have heard good things about him, but this particular song is just, um, I don't know. And not that all the music I like is necessarily, you know, um, I don't know I, today I was listening to Slayer, and I, okay, yeah, there's a few people I would object to him for obvious reasons, but they're better. They're, Anything they their worst song is better than Hey Ya. I mean Hey Ya is just such again I can't really speak about all the outcast music, but Hey Ya, 94 million views. I mean, ugh, it's crazy. It's it's um it's a, such a piece of crap. I just I don't know ugh, why they even wrote it. It's just like one of the worst songs ever. It's stupid. And the video, the video. To be fair, watch the video. And the video is just bad. It's, um, you know, uh, how do you, where do you start? Uh, horror, horror, it's like no choreography whatsoever. It's just like all over the place. So I say that because you don't really know what's what and it's stuff flashing all over. Uh, nothing coming together. It's like, it's over here, it's over there. And there's like, uh, there's like, you know, it shows, I don't know what's supposed to be, like a, an older TV, but then somebody has a Polaroid in the audience, and then they're using modern equipment, somebody has a, so, I don't know, it's just very, very, very confusing. But, very horrible song, very bad song. Um, I do not understand, and I, you know, I probably should have made a video a lot sooner about it. Um, but I just do not understand how anybody actually thinks that's good music. It's just one of the, oh, most horrible things I've ever heard. Are there things that are worse? I don't, I don't know. That's a trick question. Um, you know, certainly somebody like Miley Cyrus and Justin, Be Justin Bieber, they'd be contenders. But I don't even know if they would be worse than Hey Ya. Again, not necessarily Outkast, but that Hey Ya is just, uh, that particular song is just so bad. Um, it just, it, 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 it's just, I mean, it sounds like, um, I don't know, they went to a garage sale, bought a couple of, uh, used instruments that somehow made a sound but didn't quite work, and then, um, <laughs> just fucking, uh, excuse me, just do some, um, random words to it and just, you know. This is what we're gonna metaphorically uh, regurgitate as so-called intellectual creative creatism uh, or whatever. Um, but it was ooh, so bad on so many levels. Uh, video was hard. I mean, hard to watch. But I did watch it. Um, unfortunately, um, it was. Probably about as bad as the second X Files movie, which was pretty bad. Um, be, I mean, this song may be worse. That's how bad it is. This song is 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 just it's bad on a whole new level, on so many levels. It's just uh, how anybody could actually like this song. I mean, 
I could see it has a catchiness to it, so maybe in passing you kind of whatever. Or, uh, I don't know, but how this could even, I, I mean, I've heard it on the radio recently. I was like, really? How is it played on the radio? How is that possible? Um, of course, you know, there's going to be some fans of the song. It has 94 million views uh, as of, you know, when I checked a couple minutes ago. So, I guess it has some kind of falling, but it's just, I'm sorry. Again, I don't I hate Outkast per se. I don't know much about the music. don't really care much about it. Not my forte, but this particular song is just, it's just, oh my goodness, so annoying, so annoying. Um, I know you take the worst Kiss song, it's not this bad. You take the worst, uh, you know, even Ken, Kevin Bloody Wilson, or Royal Dialogue Yankovic, or um, Adam Sandler. I mean, there's so many other musicians or comedic musicians that... Um, may not have the skill set that somebody like Outkast does, but on this particular song, it's just, it's, 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 uh, pretty bad, pretty bad, and, um, of course, I know the song will go away, unfortunately, unfortunately, I can't unrelease it, but, um, I can't voice my opinions on it, say how bad it is, and say that, I mean, Probably gonna get some nasty replies to this, maybe. But I'm sorry, anybody that actually likes a song, you just you just don't know what you're talking about. Now, granted, um, some of the music I like, very same thing can be said. But this this one is bad on a whole new level. It's just <sighs> just can't stand. It. Just really, really, really um, grinds my gear, so to speak, to you bar a popular line. But this this one just ground my um friggin' gears and broke them, it just, it's like, um, you know, somebody says, Jimmy Crack Corn, and I don't care, over and over again, after about, you know, 50 times, it kind of gets, that's how I feel, as soon as I hear a song, it's like, oh, again, I still didn't stop playing this, and there's so many more songs that are so much more wonderful, you know, even my R&B, hip-hop, jazz, other, whatever, if you want to go into the same genre, or whatever many other songs we could play fortunately have to suffer through that one sometimes but i don't like it uh, i think the song should be unreleased if that's possible and that's probably not that's not possible but uh, i just i hate the song uh, musically it just seems like i don't know like it was it's probably maybe something like they were in a studio in between takes of you know actual songs they're going to put on the records and maybe it was like uh they were goofing around and it was never meant to be released but it was because that's what bands do you go in and you record 20 30 40 songs for some bands that have bigger money and can stay in the studio more and then years later after they're retired they're like Ooh, the hidden unreleased material or that's how you know tupac for example puts out an album every couple years because every time he went in to record one there was all the stuff that was never going to be on the album anyway but that he's dead, they can just, you know, go back and, um, for example, so, uh, I think it was one of those kind of throwaway songs, but somehow made it on the album, and it just, oh, oh, it's just horrible, horrible, tragic, just so tragic, and sad that, I mean, somebody could actually put something like that out, so, um, Hey Ya uh, by Outcast is just, um, sorry, it is total crap, and, um, trying to keep this clean, I know, some of the comments may be negative and may contain, contain language, whatever. I'm trying to keep this as objective as possible. I'm not using the words to describe how I really feel about it, but it's such a piece of crap. And there's another word besides crap I would like to use. It just effing sucks so bad. Um, it's just so... It's hard to listen to. Um... So, excuse me, so, um, I don't know, wish the song would go away, or, there is one thing I could, maybe, maybe I could do a parody of it, like, use the song, put my own words to it, but then it would have to be about a different subject altogether, so I, I don't know, but maybe that would be a different way to mock it, perhaps, perhaps, but that's, uh, something for another day. But I just wanted to uh, speak with you for a few minutes, describe my displeasure on the song that I, 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 I just, it's ever since I heard it. And I remember 
when uh, Howard Stern was still in the air before it went to satellite radio, and they had Outcast had just been on, and I, I actually caught the show that day um, a few minutes after like Outcast had just left the studio, and they come back from commercial, and they were like, eh, and this was Outcast, and everybody that called in was like, that music is ridiculous, it doesn't make any sense, and and I know Howard and Robin and everybody was like, oh, it's so great, and it's. Dead. And normally, you know, I agree with them on most things, but that was one case where they were wrong. I mean, it's it's just atrocious. Hey, uh, by Outcast is just, I mean, it's it's bad. It's bad. It's it's like, um, I don't know. It's like, um, I don't know. I don't know. I really don't know what to compare it to off the top of my head, but it's just something that's really, really been irritating me for a very little time. And I felt it was time to finally talk about it a little bit and some of the reasons why it irritates me and uh, express my displeasure with the song and how much it sucks and how much a piece of crap it is. And um, again, I'm not don't hate outcast as people or a band or necessarily the whole body of work, but this particular song is absolutely worthless. And um, I didn't want to express that. And uh, thanks for watching. And. Uh, have anything to say in response to this, please comment. Uh, I don't know what kind of response I'll get, so if I get an overwhelming response, it's like, if you and all this, then I'll try to answer the comments as best as I can. But um, either way, whatever you think of this video, please comment. I'll try to respond as much as I can and uh, maybe get a discussion going. Maybe you can let me know why you think the song is good, because it's just, it's not. But why would it have 94 million views? I mean... A big name, I get it, whatever, a few million views, but 94 million views on that video, oh, it's just like, it's like, oh, it's like a horror movie, almost like, I saw the 94 million, it was like a scary movie in a theater, you know, and, and you're by yourself, so you're not like hiding from your date or anything, so you're like, you, you actually cover your eyes and nobody's looking at you, it's like, 94 million, no, ah, it's like, Million. How can I have 94 million? But <sighs> so, so, mm. tragic, tragic. And what's more tragic is this is just a regular drink. I should have alcohol in it. All this just, just made me more stressed out for this crappy song. <sighs> okay. So, um, thanks for watching my video and see you again soon. Thank you.